Bruno Giovanni Quidaciolo, Jr. was an American film and television actor. He was known for his roles in the Hollywood film City Slickers, When Harry Met Sally. Good Morning, Vietnam, The Godfather Part II, and Donnie Brasco. Early Life, Kirby was born Bruno Giovanni Quidaciolo, Jr. in New York City, New York. His father is actor Bruce Kirby. His brother, John Kirby, is a notable acting coach. Kirby attended Power Memorial Academy. Career Kirby was a popular character actor through the late 1980s and early 1990s. His film debut was in 1971's The Young Graduates. It was his role in The Godfather Part II as the young Peter Clemenza that raised his profile in Hollywood. In the summer of 1972, Kirby, in one of his early television appearances, portrayed Anthony Ghirelli, the son of Richard Castellano's character Joe Ghirelli, in the television situation comedy The Super. Castellano had played the older Pete Clemenza in The Godfather. Other television appearances include Room 222 and the pilot episode of MASH, playing the character Boone. He also appeared in the 1974 Columbo episode By Dawn's Early Light alongside Father Bruce Kirby and in the season 2 episode Seance of Emergency, where he was credited as B. Kirby, Jr. Described by film critic Leonard Moulton as the quintessential New York and all cranky straight man, Kirby displayed his talents in a series of comedies, typically playing fast-talking, belligerent, yet likable characters. His best-known roles include a colleague of Albert Brooks' film editor in Modern Romance, a talkative limo driver in This Is Spinal Tap, the jealous, comedically impaired Lieutenant Hawk in Good Morning, Vietnam, and a shifty assistant to Marlon Brando Euro a parody of his godfather role a Euro in The Freshman. Kirby balanced comedies with dramatic roles like Donnie Brasco as a double-dealing mobster, Kirby and comedian Billy Crystal made a popular screen team in When Harry Met Sally and City Slickers. Both featured Kirby's character as the opinionated best friend to Crystal's character. Kirby refused to sign on for the sequel City Slickers 2, The Legend of Curly's Gold unless script changes were made, and was subsequently replaced by John Lovitz. In 1991, Kirby made his Broadway debut when he replaced Kevin Spacey in Neil Simon's Lost in Yonkers. In the last decade of his life, Kirby had success in the animated film Stuart Little, and was increasingly working on television. He starred as Barry Skeck in a 2000 CBS drama American Tragedy, played a paroled convict in a season 3 episode of Homicide, Life on the Street, and also directed an episode of that show. Personal Life and Death Kirby married actress Lynn Sellers on September 29, 2003. Kirby died on August 14, 2006, from complications related to leukemia. According to the Associated Press and other news reports, his widow stated that he had only recently been diagnosed with the disease. Kirby, like his character in This Is Spinal Tap, was a fan of Frank Sinatra. He enjoyed playing softball in the late 1970s. He was also very allergic to horses, and needed daily allergy shots on the set of City Slickers. In 2006, less than six months before his death, Kirby was invited to be a member of Actors Studio. Filmography Awards and nominations References External links Bruno Kirby at the Internet Movie Database MSNBC article on Kirby's death, Washington Post obituary